hit the elevator button. Okay, I'm on the second floor. Okay. Nothing in there, I'm shocked. All right, well, I got the elevator open. Let me just... Try this door. Can't, okay. All right, well, back to the elevator we go, then. Oh, hi. That doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. Okay. Doesn't matter. Just, just get out. I want to go... down. That's the vision I just found, okay. Am I still going? Yup, been going for about an hour. Treatment rooms, how about we don't go that way? Oh, I guess. dead. Oh, 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 you're very dead. Oh, God. Oh, no. Where's Anna? She turned, didn't she? And the only reason she didn't kill me was because I sleep like the dead, right? Okay. If you see... If you see one... You shut up and you freeze. Oh god, no. Can't open these, can I? No, okay. Back to the middle. Alright. Okay. Oh, this isn't good. This is not good. I know this. This is where I started, right? Whoever it was was standing right here. And there was a chair here, and I was sitting there. I know I know this room. This is where we started. God. Okay. Um come on. Billy! No, this is for your own good. You're safe and sorry. Please. Please, I gotta eat. Me, we should give him something to chew on. It's out of the question. It's it Billy. It would the veracity of the tests. It's Billy. William Bates is Billy Bates. Oh my god, I can't believe I didn't put that together before. It's Billy. Oh no. And we know what he becomes, don't we? We've seen firsthand what he becomes. Oh god. Okay. Oh no. Can I go in here? Nope. All right. Which way is the way out? I don't remember from the main game, damn it! That was not me. That wasn't me. He 
these controls are going to be my death because they're so weird. It's in here. I heard it coming down the hallway from where I just came from. It's in here. Billy? I don't know. I don't know. So I was a doctor. But I don't remember who I am. Why? What happened? Did I see something I wasn't supposed to see so they wiped my memory? I don't know. Security station sounds good. Not like I would want to really open any of these doors. Cool. Whatever. Laboratory. That's the stairs. this I can't find where you are who are you I'm a patient I'm a patient all right I just needed to know you weren't uh, one of those things I don't want to freak you out but I've been keeping my eye on you shit that's one of them it's close by Anyone back the way you came? Not a living soul. I don't know what's going on. But you better come with me. This way. Okay. God, he scared me. I thought it was a Wendigo, so I shut up real quick. Did you notice I didn't scream? <laughs> oh god. I wish I could go faster. Working on it. I'm coming. Oh god, this is not gonna be good. David, you're gonna die. Better safe than sorry. That's not gonna help anything. I know what you're doing back there. That's not gonna help anything. What is this? What is this room? This is like Jaws, where they don't show you the shark till near the end. The whole damn place was starting to feel like a ghost town. Well, well, it's still a ghost town. Thank you. That stick ain't gonna do jack shit for you, bruh. Just saying. Shotgun or fire is your only... And I don't think you have shotguns in a hospital. At least one wouldn't hope so. God. So yeah. You're fucked. I'm fucked. We're all fucked. Okay. I think we're okay. For the time being anyway. I'm David. I work here. How long have you been in here? Weeks? Months, maybe. Yeah. Some patients can't even remember what day it is. I get it. Why are you alone here anyhow? Everybody already left. You piss someone off? I don't know what happened. This whole place has got the stench of something rotten. Since they brought those miners here, they were supposed to get better. Jesus. Better. Not exactly what I'd call it. Right? What happened? Well, hard to say exactly, but 
Something changed with the miners. They went wild. Though. They were possessed, like turned into literal monsters. Yeah. You've never seen anything like it. I have. <laughs> I wish I could bought it from my mind. We gotta keep moving. There are other survivors. They're not far. Come on. Is that what happened to me? Okay. Other survivors, you say? Thank you. You're a real gentleman, David. Oh, God. All right. Follow me. Sure thing. Sure thing, boy. Come near me, will you? We're almost to Rag Docking. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. Everybody else is holed up with Ted in the chapel. I'd be there too, but you know Brad. I don't There's actually. Always something with him. You had to go back, and Suzanne and I are his escort. They should be waiting for me at the dock. I came out here to scope it out. Well, we know Brad doesn't turn. As we find his body. Watch your step. Oh. Take it nice and slow. Sorry, I'm kind of falling behind here. Okay. This ain't gonna be good. Not at all. I'm coming. Oh, more blood. <laughs> that bodes well. Me too. Me too. Yeah, the one thing about Rush of Blood that I was really disappointed about was when the Wendigo showed up, the whole don't move thing wasn't a mechanic. Um, I just thought with VR that would be really cool, so I hope this game finally capitalizes on that. Because if it doesn't, I'm going to be really disappointed. It's a, such a missed opportunity to have a creature like the Wendigo that's based on sound and sight and have a game that's in VR with voice registration... If, I, if there's a point where I don't have to sit still and shut the fuck up, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be bummed. And if there is, I'm gonna shit my pants. Here. Hey, it's the main menu music. Well, there you go. You finally starting to come along? Can't be too careful. Things first. Well, it's that, that's that's gonna that's not gonna keep them out. It's gonna keep us in, bruh. Would it kill you to leave one open? Just saying. Brad's office is right down there. I'm hearing things. He's playing a song called that says like I'm sorry and stuff on it. Up to you to prevent breakouts. Well, I see you did your job. I'm coming. Brad was not exactly pleased someone called him the cops. Guess he's worried they'll catch a whip of something they ain't supposed to. There's something in here. Hold on, David. Oh, this is gonna go well. Wait! Oh my god, I know this room! I know this room! I've seen this tape! Is that Billy? Yep, I have seen this tape. Trophy, yay! Oh, damn. Hearing about it's one thing. Seeing it. <sighs> she was a good lady. Didn't deserve that. Yeah. 
Yep, Mike finds this exact same tape. That's so crazy. I know exactly what room I'm in right now. That's crazy. This is so crazy. Oh, good lord. Okay. I thought you were behind me. I hope when the police show up, they plug every last fucking line that they see. Well, it's a little late for that. Bullets won't do anything anymore. Yep. This is Bragg's office. I know this. Oh my god, I've been here before. Is I didn't recognize that one. Yeah, Billy, I think it was Billy's file? It was right down here. And here we are, at Honcho himself. He's dead. He's hey, dead. um, it's David, can I come in? He's not dead, all right. He's sitting in the chair. Mr. Bragg, Suzanne, found someone else needs an escort. Hi. I, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Anna? As am I. We thought you'd, well, suffered the same fate as the others. You deceived me. About your uh, roommate. Yes. Anna's a dear friend and colleague. One of our staff doctors. Not a patient. I'm sorry, but the deception was necessary. I needed to observe your progress as closely as possible. It was all in an effort to ensure your recovery. I know this is difficult, but can you tell me if any more memories have resurfaced? Of what mine now? Bits and pieces? Mm hmm. Rest assured, your memory will return in time. Though none of this really matters anymore. I, I should never have come back. Sorry, I... I thought I could right the ship. But you can't steer a ship in a squall. What do you mean? Mr. Bragg, you've been down before. You'll pull us all through. I know you will. Hey. Oh, Suzanne. This I is not the same. I admire your optimism, but it's misplaced to me. What are you doing? This is, uh... Oh. It's just too big to keep quiet. Well, it sure seemed to keep quiet. No, Mr. Bragg, please, let's just go to the chapel. The, the storm's let up. The police are yeah. on their way. To the chapel. Thank you. Go, now. I'm staying here. We can't leave you behind. It's not safe. Please. You know we all have to go. Everyone, Bragg included. You should come with us. Stop! Enough! This place belongs to me. And I belong to it. Get the hell out of here. I know Mr. he's Brad. not leaving. Suzanne, stop. Come on. He's made up his mind. No. No. We gotta go now while we still can. Bye, buddy. I know you never leave this chair. You do not look good at all. Man. Be careful with your charge. Right information at the wrong time can turn apples into sand. Bragg, don't forget who's really responsible for all this. What, the, the miners? Bye, buddy. I mean, I, I knew he wasn't leaving. <laughs> I just wondered what would happen if I tried to coax him along. And he got made. Anna, wait up. You have some explaining to do. Oh, oh Bennett, good lord. Hold on. Bennett? Who who the heck is Bennett? Bennett? Is that is that me? I'm not Bennett. Anna Bennett? I don't freaking know. There's 
don't understand. Why wouldn't Brad want to come with us? Bill, like, would you be able to leave that behind? If it meant not dying? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would. <laughs>